How to enable dark mode for every website with Dark Reader. The first thing you'll need is a Chromium browser to install Dark Reader onto. So whether that's Google Chrome, the Brave browser, or Microsoft Edge, either one of them will do. I currently have the Brave browser open, so I'm just going to maximize my Brave browser client here. So I'm just going to navigate to the bottom and left click on it. Once you've opened up your browser, you want to navigate to the following URL address, which is https colon slash slash chrome.google.com slash web store slash category slash extensions. Once you're here, you want to left click on this text box here on the top left hand corner and then type the following dark reader and then hit enter. Once you've done that, you'll get a list of extensions here and you're going to be picking the first one here called Dark Reader, which enables dark mode for all sites. So I'm just going to left click on it here. And as you can see, at the recording of this video, it's got over 2 million plus users and over 7,000 reviews. So all you need to do now to install this extension is to add it to your browser. So you want to navigate to the top right hand corner here where it should say add to and then your browser name. So of course I'm using Brave, so it says add to Brave. All you need to do is left click on this blue button here and then you'll get this notification which says Brave has not reviewed this extension for security and safety. Only install this extension if you trust the developer. Of course this developer is trusted due to the number of users and the reviews. So all you need to do is left click on it, add extension here and then Dark Reader will begin downloading and installing onto your browser. Once Dark Reader has been installed, you'll be greeted with another window here where you can support the creators of Dark Reader if you wish. Before I close this window here, what I recommend doing is actually pinning Dark Reader to your browser. So all you need to do to do this is navigate to the top right hand corner here and left click on the jigsaw icon, also known as extensions. Once you've done that, locate Dark Reader here and then left click on pin extension icon to pin it. Once you've done that, you should see on the top right hand corner here, you have the little dark reader icon here. I'm just going to left click on this just to show you some additional options and settings that you have with dark reader. So as you can see, currently dark reader is on. The current mode is dark. You also have the option to change it to light. You have the option to adjust the brightness and the contrast and other options here. However, for me, the current default settings is adequate. So I'm just going to click out of it here. And now let's navigate to some of these tabs here that I have open to demonstrate Dark Reader. So I'm just going to left click on Yahoo Finance here. And as you can see, it was the white theme previously, and now it has been changed to the dark theme by Dark Reader. Let's navigate to the next tab here, which is the Google tab. I'm just going to left click on it here. And as you can see, again, it changes from white to dark. And now let's navigate to the next tab, which is my YouTube homepage. I'm just going to left click on it here. And as you can see, dark mode has also been enabled on this web page. All right, guys, that pretty much concludes the video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to give this video a like, comment down below, and most importantly of all, subscribe to support the channel. I'll see you on the next video. Is it so I to let you go?